My question is, how could you get the public involved in helping whatever, city hall or other things so we can keep our budget in balance? Question, please. Volunteer people. Okay. Well, I know that the city has just put together a plan much like what they have over in Lake Elsinore that asks for volunteers. You fill out your form. They assess you and see where they can place you. So you can help with the city. There are plenty of opportunities, and they will see your strengths and use you in a position that will benefit the community. As far as, are we talking parks, Sharon, or just general In general, volunteer? parks, city hall, whatever, so that we can keep our budget in balance. Well, we can't force people to volunteer. Right. However, we can make it, you know, available for them when they do have the time. Everyone's strapped with, with time. But I think we need to make it important that they and everyone know that it doesn't take every day an hour. It's whatever you can when you can serve. So come out and serve. I think, it, um, first of all, we're required to have a balanced budget. By the state so our budget is balanced we can't we can't take on more debt when we have the money to pay we have two reserve type funds that the problem is the revenue coming in is flat and the state may be taking more money uh, we do have two interns working at City Hall right now we got through the EDA program out of Temecula and they are being they're college graduates and they can't find jobs and they're well qualified. We're getting, we're paying nothing for them. EDA is paying for them to work in our city. Um, as far as the public getting involved, it may be the things we're seeing with with the parks, like uh, Little League paying for their own water, um, things like that. As far as at City Hall, we're so jammed at City Hall, we don't have space for people to come in there. But there may be opportunities. Uh, you know, most of the work is professional level, but, you know, suggestions from people are always fine and there may be opportunities for people to do things. Thank you. Vol volunteers are one of the most important parts of the city, I think. It was volunteers that made us a city. It was volunteers that first started our fire department here. Um, it was volunteers who come to us to meetings like this and willing to volunteer their time. The WCC, volunteers. That's what Waltemar is about. We're a small community and a community of volunteers. And there are lots of ways that can be helped at City Hall. Cheryl and I have talked about on the Economic Committee of having volunteers. Maybe we give them a list of here's companies and here's the form letter we want. Do the form letter, get them all in envelopes, get them ready for us to mail. On a volunteer basis, maybe from your home. We don't have a lot of room at City Hall. Um, but we have three employees, that's it. Frank doesn't have a secretary. There's nobody to plan his time and help him. So volunteers would be really an important part of, I think, a volunteer patrol system like we have in, some, uh, in uh, the farm. Those are all volunteers that go out and patrol and help keep crime away from the farm. Volunteers are wanted, needed, and cared about in this community. Thank you.